weather. Formation of clouds. Water vapors continue to rise from oceans, river, and lakes. They mix up with the air. When these vapors go up in the air in the air they douch when these vapors go up in the air. They touch cooler air and condense to form of tiny from clouds or the condensed form of tiny drops of water that floats in the air. Types of clouds. Clouds are of several types. Sometimes clouds look very small, bigger, thicker, dark, and light color. Cumulus clouds. These clouds are light and smoke in the sky and not more than 1.609 kilometers above of the ground. Cirrus clouds, the clouds which are higher in the atmosphere, called cirrus clouds, they are very thin and made of particles of ice. Sometimes they are 15 kilometers high from the ground, their color is white and they can move as fast as 193 to 321 kilometers an hour. Startus clouds, these clouds are like a gray sheet covering the sky, they are usually an indication of coming rain in fact, they are the clouds which bring heavy rain. Rain. Rain is drops of water falling from clouds when water vapors go higher in the air. They touch the cool air they condense and get bigger and bigger. They become so heavy that they are unable to stay in the air and fall from the clouds in form of water drops. Snowfall. When water vapors go higher in the air these water vapors freeze in the air before they condense to water drops this is snow usually. It falls on hills and mountain regions. It falls in the form of snowflakes. Snowflakes are soft and light cotton flowers. Hailstones. They're ice cold drops of water and snowflakes up in the clouds. These frozen drops fall from clouds and while falling down, they hit other drops and snowflakes. A layer of snow covers the frozen drops as the drops keep falling and touching snowflakes. The layer of snow gets thicker. These drops change into small pieces of ice or hailstones. Hailstones fall only when there is a thunderstorm. They are formed in a big, thick and dark clouds called thunderhead. Sometimes, hailstones are small like a pea or gram sometimes. They are as big as an egg or even bigger in size. Windstorm. When air gets hot, it goes upwards. Cool air rushes in to take its place. Temperature is different at different places on Earth. Therefore, temperature of air in different regions near the Earth is also different. When hot air goes up and cool air rushes to fill the gap, a strong wind begins to blow. Cold wind blow from regions of low temperature on Earth towards regions of high temperature. Wind gets stronger is called it windstorm. This windstorm causes great damage. It destroys crops, gardens and small houses. It uproots trees, electrical poles and telephone poles. Water vapors. Amount of water in gaseous phase which is called water vapor. Dew cause of the dew drops are formed because of condensation of water vapors water vapors is in the air called moisture or humidity whenever quantity of moisture is in hot air with respect to cold air and night this hot air contacts any cold surface water vapor present in it condenses on the cold surface in the form of droplets these tiny drops of water are called dew drops humidity Amount of water vapor present in a volume of air considered is called humidity gaseous phase present in the air. Moisture. Moisture is associated with the water content in liquid phase present in air and any substance wet steam has water in gaseous phase as well as liquid phase. Liquid water present in the steam is called moisture. Fog. Fog is a visible clouds in air near to ground consisting of tiny water droplets. Clouds can form at many different altitudes while fog only forms near the ground.